D do you think that's Lady Yai? Oh, no wonder Junya is so excited. She has a really striking presence. Also, is it just Paimon? Or did she look right at us just now? Eh, it was probably nothing. Keep away. Keep away from... I gave up the art of the sword. Please, let me go, I beg you. As you can see, Lady Yai, Domon has persisted in this state for some time now. He appears to see those who have lost to him in duels past, gathered all around him to persecute him. Lady Yai, it must be a possession, right? This is nothing like him at all. In the past, no matter what came his way, he would always face it with a, a confident smile. Hmm. I'm sorry. It is clear to me that your sensei is not possessed by any evil spirit. But... then d does that mean he... Hmm, yes. This is a change in the person himself. Unable to cope with the tremendous pressure he was under, he suffered a spiritual collapse. With his wits impaired, he finally descended into... madness. As one who is thrown into the sea, though he fights back desperately against his predicament, it does nothing to prevent his descent into the depths. As for what has triggered this change, I believe it must be the lost- Stripped of his ambition? But Lady Yai, even without his ambition, why should he suffer so- Your school practices make you Shisui art, does it not? Stillness of mind, freedom from all agitation. <laughs> what a fine notion that would be if any in this world could ever hope to achieve it. There was once one who claimed to be indifferent to rank and reward, and who fled enraged when defeated by his junior. Then, what of the one who crossed blades with his own sensei and beloved fellow disciple, and defeated them both? Lady, I, I, I'm not sure I under- uh, The path of the sword master is filled with twists and turns. It is no small undertaking to pursue the position of greatest sword master in the world. It requires one to take their sword firmly in both hands and cut down the hopes and dreams of others. Even those of only a deep commitment to his ambition to become the best made it possible for him to rise above the pain of these encounters. When that ambition disappeared, he began to doubt himself. <laughs> My poor sensei. To think he's been I'm sorry. Father, that's enough. Huh? Isn't that Ansai? Did he follow us the whole way? Ansai? Why are there two of you? Is that you? You're here for revenge, aren't you? You're right to assume that my feelings towards you are far from kindly. <sighs> it's been so long now that I made peace with it years ago. You did nothing wrong that day. I just... I don't think most of the people you beat along the way would hold it against you. On the contrary, when you cut our ambition short, we entrusted them to you in the hopes that they might carry you further. Now I know that we can't place our hopes in you any longer, but that is no reason to strip them of theirs. Follow the way of the sword all the way- But what if one day, the same thing- I put everything I had into trying to become the best. But what if- if there's a chance they'll end up like me one day, I'd rather they- Have you asked them what they think? Sensei, after you rescued me from the hands of the pirates, I told myself I would- I can't know whether I will suffer in my future as you do now. I want to keep going until the day that I can stand before everyone, with my head held high. Nanako's far from the only one. Actually, all of us think- Goodness. You see, you can place the ambition you once had in their hand. Being stripped of your ambition is something that's never happened to me, so I can't claim to understand it, but I do know what it feels. So, just as I once placed my ambitions onto you, you are not in the same- I, I'm sorry to have made you worry for me. I no longer have the resolve to become the best in the- But as your sensei, I shall commit to imparting- a This is my promise. You can count on, but, uh, well. So even though his ambition was taken away, his disciples- Traveler, a moment, please. So, my intuition was correct. 
The wind that blows from afar carries fresh life to these shores. For us to meet now is premature. Nevertheless, you set foot on these islands at precisely the right moment. Hmm, I have high hopes for you, child. Don't disappoint me. Ooh, Lady Yacht! She seems super mysterious. Paimon, hmm. We can come. 